morning, my friends. It's wonderful to have you with us this morning. I'm Miss Rachel, and this is Sensory Storytime with William Jean's Memorial Library, and we're so happy that you're here today. We are gonna start, as we always do, with a welcome song, and I have a handful of friends who I know are watching live, and I am thrilled to be able to sing your name in our welcome song, but if you're watching, and you didn't respond to let me know that you'd be here and you would like me to sing your name, you can put your name um, in the comments and I would love to sing to you too. After our welcome song, we'll read our first book and then we'll do another song and we'll get moving a little bit with that one. And then when we get to this song, you'll know it's time for shaking. When we get here, we'll do the shaker song and you can use anything you want to shake if you have shaker eggs like that you can use those but if you don't that's okay you can find something else that makes a noise that you can shake when we get here we'll do a scarf song and just like with the shaker eggs you can use anything at all like a scarf anything you can wave around can be your scarf for the scarf song and then we will end with bubbles of course so let's start with our welcome song and sing good morning to our friends Hello Eva, hello Eva, hello Eva, we're glad you're here today. Hello Luca, hello Luca, hello Luca, we're glad you're here today. Hello Lorenzo, hello Lorenzo, hello Lorenzo, we're glad you're here today. Hello Lena, hello Lena. Hello, Lena, we're glad you're here today. Hello, Logan. Hello, Logan. Hello, Logan, we're glad you're here today. Hello, Max. Hello, Max. Hello, Max, we're glad you're here today. Hello, Janya. Hello, Janya. Hello, Janya, we're glad you're here today. Hello, Brayden. Hello, Brayden. Hello, Brayden. We're glad you're here today. Hello, Kaylin. Hello, Kaylin. Hello, Kaylin. We're glad you're here today. We're so glad you're all here. Make sure I didn't miss anybody. Nope. Thank you for joining us. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We are going to read our first book and it is called Splash. It's by Flora McDonnell, both the words and the beautiful illustrations. And I'm gonna read it to you with permission from Candlewick Press, the publisher. And I'm gonna get a little bit closer to make sure you can see what is splashing in this book. Splash. Hot, hot, hot. The elephants are hot. Tiger is hot. Rhinoceros is hot. Let's follow the baby down to the water. Lovely water. Water to drink. Water to squirt. Squirt, squirt, squirt. Splash goes Mother Elephant. Sploosh goes Rhinoceros.
Whoosh, sploosh, goes Tiger. Splash, 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 splash. Now Tiger is cool and happy. Now Rhinoceros is cool and happy. Now Mother Elephant is cool and happy. What a happy, cool, clever little baby elephant. A good idea baby elephant had to go down to the water so everyone could cool off. It's not so hot today. It's starting to feel a little bit like fall, isn't it? A little bit cooler, but those animals were very, very hot and they needed to go down to the water to cool off. I chose for our first book a very short book because our second one is going to be a little bit longer. But before we read that one, we're going to get moving a little bit. So my computer screen is only this small, which means I can't do all of the things in front of the camera that you can do at home while we do this song. So you can take all the space you need to do all the moving you need for this song. All right, you ready? Everyone can clap, 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 clap. Everyone can clap, 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 here at story time. Everyone can sway, 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 sway. Everyone can sway, 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 here at story time. Now this is where I'm going to end up leaving the screen. Are you ready? Everyone can jump, 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 jump. Everyone can jump, jump, jump here at story time. Did you jump too? Let's see. This one, you're not going to see my feet. Actually, I wonder if I can move the camera and you can see my feet. Let's get a little crazy here. We're going to stomp. Are you ready? There we go. Everyone can stomp, stomp, stomp. Stomp, 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 stomp. Everyone can stomp, stomp, stomp here at story time. That's new. I haven't done that before. But now it's going to take me a minute to get this back right. I hope I'm not making you too dizzy. There we go. All right, let's see. Everyone can wave, 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 wave. Everyone can wave, wave, wave. Here at story time, everyone can stretch, 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 stretch. Ooh. Ooh. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Everyone can stretch, stretch, stretch. Here at story time, everyone can spin, 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 spin. spin. Everyone can spin, spin, spin here at story time. Are you dizzy yet? I'm getting dizzy. Everyone can sit back down. Whoa. Sit back down, sit back down. Everyone can sit back down here at story time. Let's see. Oh, we forgot to march. Are you ready to march? You can stand up and march. Everyone can march, 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 march. Everyone can march, march, march here at story time. Everyone can clap, 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 clap. Everyone can clap, clap, clap here at story time. Good job, everybody. Now we're all nice and warmed up from our song. Let us read our next book. This is one that I hadn't read before to you or even to myself, and I really like it a lot, so I can't wait to share it with you. Maybe you've seen it. It's called The Good 
Egg. It's by Jory John and Pete Oswald. Let's check out the good egg. I'm going to read this with permission of Harper Collins Publishers. The Good Egg. Oh, hello. I was just rescuing this cat. Know why? Because I'm a good egg. A very good egg. It's true. I do all kinds of good things, like I'll carry your groceries, I'll water your plants, I'll change your tires, I'll paint your house. If you need any help whatsoever, I'm your egg. always been a good egg. It's been this way from the start, even in my earliest days. Back at the store, there were a dozen of us living together under one recycled roof. There was Meg and Peg and Greg and Clegg and Shell and Shelly and Sheldon and Shelby and Egbert and Frank and other Frank. Oh, the other 11 eggs weren't on their best behavior. They weren't exactly good. They ignored their bedtime. They only ate sugary cereal. They threw tantrums. They cried for no reason. They broke their stuff on purpose. Meanwhile, I tried to take charge. I tried to fix their bad behavior. I tried to keep the peace because I was a good egg. A very good egg. Nobody seemed to care, though. Every night I was exhausted. My head felt scrambled. Then, one fateful morning, I noticed some cracks in my shell. Yikes! They were everywhere. Oh, no. My doctor said it was from all the pressure I was putting on myself. The pressure of making sure everybody was as good as me. I was cracking up. Literally, something had to change. I'd had enough. I told Meg and Peg, and Greg, and Clegg, and Shell, and Shelly, and Sheldon, and Shelby, and Egbert, and Frank, and other Frank, that I was leaving. I can't be the only good egg in a bad carton, I said. Blah, 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 they replied. I left that night. I wandered from town to town. The hours became days, the days became weeks. I lost track of time. I was alone. Out there, on the road, under the stars, I really tried to focus on myself and what I needed. And the egg cut its beard. See that? It grew a beard and then trimmed it. I took walks. I read books, I floated in the river, I wrote in my journal, I found simple moments to be quiet, I breathed in, I breathed out, I even started 
painting for once I found time for me and guess what little by little the cracks in my shell started to heal my head no longer felt scrambled I started to feel like myself again. So I've made a big decision. I'm returning to my old carton and my friends. Besides, I'm kind of lonely out here. This time I know what I need to do. I'll try not to worry so much. I'll be good to my fellow eggs while also being good to myself. Here we go. Everybody missed me. I missed them too. They made a sign that says, Welcome home. Hello, Meg. Howdy, Peg. Hey, Greg. Greetings, Clegg. What's up, Shell? Aloha, Shelly. Hey, yo, Sheldon. Hi, Shelby. Good day, Egbert. What's happening, Frank? Howdy do, other Frank. Sure, every once in a while, somebody's still a little bit bad, but it's not like before. Here's what I realized. The other eggs aren't perfect, and I don't have to be either. I'm okay with that. Yep, the old carton is back together. We're a solid dozen again. It's good to be home. Sometimes it's hard to get along with other eggs or friends if they don't do things the way you do. But what this good egg learned is that sometimes being together, you can learn to accept other people. And you can learn to get along with them and be yourself and worry less about them and take care of yourself and enjoy being with other eggs. I mean, friends. Thanks for joining me for that story. You know what that means. It's time to shake. So, remember what I said, it doesn't matter if you don't have shaker eggs. You can use a water bottle with little dried peas or beans. You can put rice in a little bottle of some kind. What else? Any kind of grain in any kind of container, plastic or glass, or you can use a maraca, or a tambourine, or a set of keys, or a baby rattle, um, or you can just use your hands or any part of your body. It won't make as much noise, but you can still shake with us. And I think we are ready to shake. Okay, let's see if I did it. Nope, I didn't. Let me try again. Here we go. This time I did. Are you ready? <laughs> Shake it, shake it, everybody, shake it. Shake it, shake it, everybody, shake it. Shake it, shake it, everybody, shake it. Come on and shake it with me. Shake it, shake it, shake it on your tummy. Shake it, shake it, shake it on your tummy. Shake it, shake it, shake it on your tummy. Come on and shake it with me. Come on, shake it up. Come on, shake it down. Come on, shake it all around. Shake it any way you want. Shake it, shake it, everybody, shake it. Shake it, 
gently, gently wave your scarf gently wave your scarf wave your scarf crazy 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 wave your scarf crazy wave your scarf wave your scarf wave goodbye wave goodbye wave goodbye wave your scarf wave goodbye wave goodbye it is almost time to say goodbye my friends but we do have one more thing to do and that is our bubbles of course so if you have bubbles and you would like to blow along together with me if you are allowed to blow them inside or take them outside or you can just enjoy watching the bubbles that i'm going to blow for you on our screen there are bubbles in the air, in the air. There are bubbles in the air, in the air. There are bubbles in the air. There are bubbles everywhere. There are bubbles in the air everywhere. There are bubbles way up high, way up high. There are bubbles way up high, way up high. There are bubbles way up high. There are bubbles in the sky. There are bubbles way up high in the sky. There are bubbles way down low, way down low. There are bubbles way down low, way down low. There are bubbles way down low. And they tickle on your toes. There are bubbles way down low on your toes. And the bubbles say goodbye. Say goodbye. And the bubbles say goodbye. Say goodbye. And the bubbles say goodbye. Say goodbye until next time. And the bubbles say goodbye. Till next time. Goodbye, bubbles. Goodbye, my friends. I can't wait to see you next time. Thank you so much for joining me and spending part of your morning together.